Hey everyone, thank you for joining me today. So today I'm just going to hop on real quick and just kind of go through the Kiwi Club, the kit for August. Um, I know, I think I might have missed July's um, showing it to you on kit. No, I had it in one haul video with some other stuff. Okay, so this one's going to be by itself. And I'm just showing you here, it's the um, August kit. It's called Scenic Roots. And inside you get these cute little... Um, airplanes and obviously matching colors and I'm just gonna stick that back inside the plastic because I don't want to lose it and then uh, over here we're gonna start with the actual uh, templates so you get this it's basically like luggage almost like a duffel bag or of course it could be you know a suitcase um, and I was looking at this because of the, the green lines, the dark green lines. Um, I know you can use those to kind of use, like make tick marks and then you would be able to, um, maybe paper piece that and put little strips on it. Um, make it like leather straps and then you have the I'm here symbol. Um, and then this is like an oversized, uh, compass. Okay, and what I like about this one, when I first saw this, I was like, oh, we got a really big sun. Because <laughs> I think you could use it. Just cut out a few more of those, you know, triangle shapes, fill it in, and you have uh, sunshine, you know. Um, or you can cut it up and put different pieces, you know, in these little sections if you wanted to. Um, or just, you know, have one solid circle for your uh, compass. So... I like those and that's a really big piece um it takes up a large uh space on your paper and then we're going to go through here with the basically like their project life cards they're about that size um so you gotta come get lost with me and then the nice check pattern on the back um and then we have the going places and doing things and you could fussy cut that out and just have the suitcase itself for uh, you know an element on your uh, layout or cards and then i like the back side that looks like all little airplanes and then flying by to say hi and I like on these, um, the double-sided ones, because if you're not, you know, feeling what the sentiment is, um, on the back side, there's usually a nice subtle pattern on the back that you can use instead if you wanted to, or, you know, use it as a backing for a project or something. I like that. I think that's cute, hitting the road. And then you have all the arrows on the back. And then this one is really cute, too. Sending smiles across the miles. <laughs> I thought that was cute. All right. And then we have the globes on the back in the light blue. Uh, this one is, yeah, I like that really pretty yellow on the back, but it was like a little checklist. This one, the top 10 moments, I like this one because you could have it on the right side or on the left side. It's like whichever way it works best for your project. And then, of course, you know, the pattern paper or the pattern on the back. And then our getaway with the date and place and then, you know, a place for you to journal. Um, now, these three are actually more like a, a square size. So instead of it being like three by four, let's say it's probably like four by four. And then um, planes on the back side of that one. I like that dark blue color. And then life was meant for good friends and great adventures, which is definitely cute with a nice neutral gray on the back. And then we have the globe, you mean the world to me, which could also be fussy cut. Um, and then the check pattern again on the back. Now this one looked interesting. Um, I believe you could cut all these out, the banners, and create your, your own banner um, using the pendants that are already there. Um, you could probably, um, punch out the circles as well using like a handheld punch or your dies. Um, that would be a lot of fun too. Or of course you could fussy cut. Um, I think that's one of the benefits of Kiwi Lane is like, 
if you're uh, starting crafting and you don't have a lot of the tools and supplies that many of the people you see online have, then you can do things like fussy cut or hand cut it out and you can still create the same projects. And then born to roam everywhere and home and then the world map on the back. So you get a lot of great cards, a lot of great details. And then I'm going to pull out the 12 by 12 papers. Now at Kiwi Lane, the paper kits, you get, um, how do I explain? You get two sets of the, um, double sheets. So you can do two double layout pages from the kits, okay? And then we have a lot of um, individual sheets that you only get the, the one, but they are double-sided. Now, I was surprised they had this large um, map of the United States um, in it, which is huge. I mean, it covers a large part of the paper, but how awesome would it be to like do this up if you're, say you're doing a big traveling across the country type thing and you want to document it, or um, if you just want to do a photo or spread about where you're living or where you've moved to and you can like mark it on the state itself. Um, and then I was trying to find all my um, desk, like a enamel dot or something like that that you could place down, but um, I didn't have time to look all over for that. Now this paper has the um, planes and cars and all different kinds of stuff on it that would be fun to um, fussy cut out. And then you have the background. I like this one. I think it's very subtle. And if you weren't thinking about the fact that it, it matches that you are here symbol, <laughs> um, it was a really nice pattern on the back of that. And the blues, they're a really nice blue. It's not, for some reason, it's looking like it's going towards more uh, the greenish side on the video here. But it really is a really pale, pretty blue. And that one is got the neutral, the triangles, and then on this one, it almost looks like a herringbone. And the one thing I like about um, Kiwi Lane kits is their colors are sort of like the muted version of some of the ones that you see out on... Um, a lot of the main kits and collections and stuff like they're always you, you have your yellows and your reds and your blues but they're like a toned down version oh this is cute are we there yet love it look you can use the map on that and do a whole journaling page just on you know travel and trying to get to you know your destination that would be hilarious and then you have the Sort of like the checkerboard on the back side, which is a very interesting pattern. Now, this one I like because it almost just looks like polka dots, but I think they're, you know, obviously shaped in like the globe and with the different colors. It's just a really fun um, pattern. And you could definitely, you know, have fun putting that on one of your like your pages, your layouts as an accent page. And then here are the double pages. So on this one, the one side is the red with like um, diagonal stripes. And then you have the gray on the other side. So I'm showing you the one side and then the opposite side. And then the other set of two papers that you get is you can choose either the yellow. Sorry for the going in and out of focus. But you have the yellow or you have another like light gray, almost taupey color, but it's the same pattern. And they've started doing that where it's the same or similar pattern on each side. It's just in different colors. So if you're more called to the reddish side, then you can, you know, use that. If you like the more neutral, you can use that side. Um, either way, I think it's fun. You know, I, I really do like the different patterns that they they give you, it's patterns that you can layer up with each other um, using a lot of the different templates, um, but it can also be incorporated with other kits. And I, I like that this paper isn't um, 
limited to just this one kit that it works with other kits just because of the the neutrality of it all if that makes sense so here are the close-ups of everything that we got um thank you guys so much for joining me today make sure you hit the like subscribe and share button um, i'm going to have a link to my um, online and in-person bestie um, beatrice's channel um all her links i want to say she links to her um store for uh kiwi lane Make sure you hit her up. If you don't have an instructor, she would be a great one for you to have. She's great at answering questions, and if she doesn't know, she'll try and help you find it. Um, but Kiwi Lean is a lot of fun. I've been on this now for a year this month, because last year, this is the month, um, the kit that I started with. So I've been very pleased. I haven't used them all, but I've definitely um, enjoyed getting them and um, I like collecting the, the templates. So um, thank you guys again. And I definitely hope that you have a great day.